I'm Vermal. Update 1.14 offers a sparkly new bazaar, where it's our familiar favorite media range map, but with some refreshed textures and some in-game objects and map design. Market stall drapes have been given a haircut. They're shorter and enable better visibility into second floor of Kia. The beloved ice cream truck is no more. A bigger, tarped truck has taken its place. The devs have added this interesting broken wall next to Kill Room. Take a look. A number of building interiors have turned a light blue or gray. These new changes and more are sure to mix up some bizarre metas. Can't wait to see y'all on the battlefield. Challenger Cup Group B. No do-overs, there's no mulligan. In the struggle, who will rise? Undefeated performance from that high take final seat. Accept and ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, if I ask for it, it's gotta be real big. I gotta make it just for my kids and for their kids. Just kids, that's wealth, years and years. Promise my brother, soon as he out to finish this bid, we finna do it bigger than anybody ever did. The odds is real big, job that's real big. Say trying a little, my God is real big. Stayed up on the grind on the cards is real big. I gotta do it big, the only way that I can live. Again, flying out, rifle in hand, got you one, two, three. Oh no! Oh, Bitch right on top of it. If there's a double kill that comes in from Kogi, you can get to the EMP inside. Oh, he's fired. Wait, but you in. Oh my god! No! That's five, four, three, one! Hey Onward Lovers, I'm Vermal. Update 1.14 offers a spark.
Hello and welcome to the Onward VR Master League. My name is Chumbit, my co-caster 24 Gray. We're here with a legendary matchup, tutorial level, with some ex-boss fight players all coming back just to have fun and no fun intended, going up against one of their biggest rivals in the past, 24 Gray. How you doing? Feeling good, Chum. Feeling good. Exciting matchup, as you said. Tutorial level versus NFI. A surprising comeback from from the ex boss fight team and uh it's gonna be interesting to see how they perform against no fun intended you know into the league now three weeks no fun intended are warmed riled up uh this is tutorial levels first week back first season back in, in about half a year you know these guys are veterans but let's see if they can knock themselves back into shape that's the real question that we're all wondering here on the desk. Um, a lot of history. I mean, tutorial level, this is... Sorry. So in, in all of my pre-shows, I've always talked about tutorial level, a.k.a. boss fight. But, you know, let's let's um, take the intel we've got here today. And, and tutorial level, they are not boss fight. They're not operating in the same way, even though they're made up of similar players. This is a completely different team with with a shifting culture from season 14, right? That was the last time Boss Fight played, right? Season 14? Yes, season 14. Um, I, I was on Boss Fight at the time and we took third place in the World Championships. Uh, unfortunately then took the hiatus for season 15 and now the back rebranded as tutorial level. As you said, the shift in, in mental uh, capacity to the game, they're just here to have a bit of fun, you know, we, we see that rebranding to tutorial level from boss fight, quite ironic, but, uh, you know, being their first season, season two, they've seen this game change a lot over the time and they're not used to the, the new gun weights, etc. but I'm sure these guys will quickly snap into shape and we're going to see a competitive matchup. You don't lose that, lose that, what is it, like four or five years worth of knowledge right. of competitive onward. Right. So I, I wouldn't underestimate then I'm hope Hennify are going into this with their whole you know, uh, guys, championship mindset. And Gray, you, you tell me your experience, but when I first loaded in to the new update, you know, with the movement and everything, it felt really very different. It, like the whole gun feel, everything felt very strange to me. And I don't know if you felt the same way. I know other people said nothing has changed for me. Uh, it might have been an isolated thing with me, but I really felt quite the change. And I'm wondering if tutorial level will feel that. This is round number one, folks, of map number three. We're here on Subway, no fun intended, defending the South Alley's OBJ. And as we just mentioned in this, just looking at the tutorial level roster, seeing the likes of Lonely Viper returning, not played this game competitively since 2021, season 11. This is this is their first matchup, you know, playing VRML competitively. We see the likes of Legil, who have had that had that experience, like on on Virtual Secret for the past few weeks. But I'm just excited, chum. That there's nothing that there's nothing that I could expect. <laughs> and, and as I say that, we see the rotation back down to the basement. <laughs> I am just in awe i mean look at this can you believe this right now i what's going on i'm not sure how to to commentate this chum just just not the meta that we we normally see some are we seeing something new here what I, the... I, i'm unsure <laughs> <laughs> a rotation onto to basement now Th these guys surely know this map and I'm unsure what this rotation is really, really doing for them. Um, okay. I mean, Radar just told Lonely that they were supposed to go Main Street. So clearly, I think they're just being humble that they're only here to have fun. But, but clearly, they have some kind of strat. Yeah, I mean, look at Scoob and Nadu pushing up overpass now. 
Is Hooch going to be ready for this? We see Deadshot and Hooch locked in on the main alley. And Suggs is already rotating into Chinatown. That's going to be detrimental. Uh, Hoochie's another big player who's been around since season two, right? That's really no joke. Um, no, not all, chum. I am looking and, forward to Sogs now that you bring them up. And, and talking about Hooch, you know, we we can throw this back to OC Five back in back in California, San Francisco, where Hooch actually participated on the big stage with the boss fight guys. You know, Hooch is an ex boss fight player, so. These guys have some history, you know, they've played together on the stage, they've played together three, three seasons at this point, um, from and, uh, and against. There's Sogs, finds Radar, a good peek. Clearly Radar wasn't ready for that. There's that confirm, and only does peek. Ooh, some shots going out, Viper finds him with the commando. That evens out, chum, Scooby. Nah, dude, peeking over past now, some smoke. There's that PKM, a smoke deployed. Nade out, watch out, Nardu. Oof. Nearly gets tagged, and oh, Hoochie finds the timing there, and a nade from Raz. Good attempt, but here comes the swing, and Scooby goes down as well. It's all lift up to one tutorial level player. Raz still resable at the bottom of South Alley, but with just under three minutes left, I don't know what the chances of that are. Here comes Viper. Wielding an MK18. Is that a is that an M203? No M23. Uh, sorry, that's a commando. I forgot. Commando. Yeah, we, we had this discussion on cast a few days ago. James Boak seemed to relight a new meta into the is it the 588 commando? Or the 558 right. commando? Right, right, right. Um with a, su <laughs> a suppressor and a red dot. Where we we did see, and I, I don't want to dull down NFI's defense too much, but Tutorial level, it's their first round. They did get the worst spawn of the two. It allowed N5 to take control pretty much all of the, the top side of the map. Right. I, I'm really more focusing on, for the first map at least, see how tutorial level can hold their defenses. Because that's going to be the key the key moment, right? If they can take this map, maybe 4-3, um, and lose to N5, then it's still a statement. You guys have come back after... Six months, and you're holding your own against one of the top teams in the EU. Well, that, that's a statement in its own. Uh oh, Flash doesn't get Viper. They do swing, and so do Mad Hatter. Who's gonna find the pick? Oh, it's Mad with a quick tar shot. It's over. First point to NFI, folks. Good try by Viper. I mean, Sogs, they've been playing consistently, Gray. Sogs has been on fire recently. And uh, it is it is uh, something to note for, for Lonely Viper that they did find that kill there on Chinatown. I think we do I do I think we do have to recognize that. Sogs, one of the newer players to the league, but someone who's really, really grown with you know the, the professional uh, the, the high level teams right and we really do see that disparity you see new players come into the league and some do sit at the lower level for quite a substantial amount of time and others that just jump in and then rise quickly past you know even some of the veteran players and Suggs is one of them you know only been in the league for a couple of seasons now and you know top fragging against the likes of the nfi team you know even some of the top na contenders it's it, He's one of those sharp young, young prospects in the league. Which, um, it, <laughs> sorry, I'm just listening to the, t to the tutorial level gossip <laughs> and uh, making me I giggle. And if I also having a, the same spawn, so let's see if Ooh. tutorial level can take take advantage of that. We have a C4 placement from Lonely Viper, and this one is a good placement. It will catch quite a few people there, but they cannot be hugging that wall. Here comes no fun intended, Gray. I mean. <laughs> What do you see? What's the what's the potential for this uh, NFI push and uh, radar sitting on overpass? What, what's the potential? What do you, how do you see the 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 cookie crumbling? Well, what I see, Chummy, is tutorial level are 
very, very much still boss fight here. You know, having played these positions with with these guys for seasons, this is the de facto fall boss fight, aka tutorial level, and they are they are and were are still are champs for a reason. You know, these defenses do hold. Let's see if their timeout can actually keep keep this defense from from crumbling. And you see how boss fight play, you know, very, very static. And they'll almost wait for NFI to, to crawl into their line of sight. No risks really taken by tutorial level. I say that as I see Radar rushing down overpass. I hope he's, he's not going to make me eat my words here. Where would Radar go? I mean, AK-12 in hand, flash as well. We, we, this, this is one of Radar's a, yeah. famous flanks here, Chum. He he did this against us on a, on the finals, and he's really going to punish NFI if he's not careful. I do think his, if he does choose to go north stairs, this is going to be very, very dangerous. Raz isn't watching the flank anymore, though they, they, do, they do have the 6 o'clock. It does seem Radar and wants to go through uh, basements. And they hear those those audio cues in Chinatown. You may see a flank around through service. This is this could be big. This could be really big. Unfortunately, the guys on Chinatown are gonna hear radar now wrap round here. And what radar's motive is to clear as much of the map so they know the NFI approach. Radar wraps up through basement here. You can call basement clear and almost predict that. All of the NFI members are going to attack through the North Valley because he's also cleared the main platform and the overpass. And look at this angle by radar. No one's going to expect this. Those SOGs may have heard those footsteps leading into the... Yeah, making some audio cues. Getting a little nervous for radar. Some pistol shots going out. But here comes SOGs. They are moving. You're right! They had no idea! There's an AK-12. Call out from Radar. this is Lurk, chum. Radar gets the pick, rotates back around, NFI will be searching for him. And he's just gone. And this is the beauty of Radar. He ducks and weaves, NFI will now try and clear that for the next minute and a half. But he's not there. He's gone. Yeah, we're past the halfway point. this is what NFI really have to be careful about. Because they're going to waste a load of pyro to try and clear Radar from that position. And he just ducks and weaves, gets into a different position, and he'll shoot you from another angle. Right. They're not home. And there's no way he's going north stairs here. This is... He's wow. running rings. This he's could be literally big. literally running rings. This could be big. Deadshot did say he could have gone through tunnels. One minute 50 One called minute. out from Raz. They got to start moving. And Raz knows that. And there he comes. Coming from the north, folks. Buckle up. We may see something big here. How are we going to see Raz drop that lurk position? He's definitely posted to watch that rotate. But they're still not certain that they've cleared. It does come the push by NFI onto the fog alley. Here comes Legil with the with a nice spot, AK-12 and a flash. What I'm really curious about is whether we're seeing some full metal jacket plays. Oh, that that's a clean headshot from Legil and dead shot swinging in. Another smoke toss. Here comes a cut and cook nade, and it goes short. Oh, maybe. Oh, oh, oh almost, almost. There's AK-104 from Lonely Viper. Look at Ooh. Radar now, chum. Radar's radar moving. slowly. Whoa, a nice trade. The revive can go out. Wow, just before the confirm. And there's the confirm. There's oh, a double by Lonely. And here comes Radar from the back. He could clean this up. Mad Hatter's no idea what's coming to him. Tutorial level. Running rings around the NFI players. Running Four rings. Up, Four up. We can't sleep on tutorial level.
I mean, these are the guys that have just come back literally today to play their first match. No scrims, no practices. Right. Bearing we saw them warm up uh, just before the lobby got rehosted. Right. But we're, we're, we're seeing their, their season's worth of knowledge coming to action here. You know, the, the map knowledge doesn't go. And realistically, the gun skill either. And we're seeing Legil take heads. We're seeing Viper take kills on some of the best EU players out there. And th this is... You know, we're, we're looking at the connoisseurs and NFI seemingly had, had this, you know, sweat under the rug before it even started. And uh, we're 1-1, Chum. And as I said, boss fight, know how to hold the defense. And that's going to be the trouble for NFI. Nearly everybody who voted for... All the connoisseurs who voted for NFI have also voted for this to be casted. And uh, looking at this drop uh, on, on uh, Mad Hatter... I have not heard any news whether this is a timeout or not, but this may be a quick roster change. Just just to just to reiterate, 28 connoisseur votes to NFI, only four for tutorial level. Oh my gosh. Okay, this may be a timeout because the auto timer went and no fun intended are not ready. Still missing their fifth. I I did hear that maybe we do have some tech issues on the NFI side. So um, maybe we do see a timeout. Okay. Well, folks, we're going to roll the replays of Subway, what we've got so far. Thank you so much for tuning in. Chumbe here with 24 Gray, witnessing history with tutorial level versus NFI. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We're here. Next OBJ of Subway. Center platform, no fun intended. Back to a five-player roster. And uh Scooby Doo in here. What? No, no, I'm going south. Oh shit, that tire is. Hey, Freeman push into overpass. Very, very boss fight. Mad Hatter gets a refrag. What? Legil traded. Legil. And another refrag. A 3v3. Lightning fast, folks. Around. Lightning fast. Is it even going to take a map, chum? I don't know. Two of their best players. You know, we talked about Sogs previously. Yeah. And he's a real real asset to nfi especially that basement who's holding the basement now we have dead viper. shot i guess oh oh on marsock yeah viper yeah but Vi viper's got that basement all to himself you know he can poke up and prod and that they also have the overpass this is a real dangerous situation that nfi are in they <laughs> they've got all of this ground secured Raz may find Scooby. I believe. Smoke deployed. Here comes. Oh my gosh! Look at Lonely Viper. Pushing aggressive here. Those need to be careful of Hooch in South Train and especially Deadshot on the West Main, but. If he does peek his head on this south double. Moving down. What? 
There goes Lonely Viper. Finds a pick on Tahuchi. Scooby Doo moving down with the smoke. Beautifully taunt. This is movement play. Gray. Gray. Nardu goes down, but Scooby st st Scooby's still here. Scoob, here's that. Raz thinks that he's killed Scooby in this position. Knowing where both the positions are now, Raz needs to crash back. I think Raz hears Scoob's wow. position. Scoob. Finding Raz. Oh, 2v1 situation. Dead shot West Main. Are we going to see a famous Scoob cap? Uh oh. Dead shot knows where both Ooh. of them are. Lonely did get this. tagged with the flash. There goes a the smoke. Can get Deadshot get get capped on? Oh, the smoke is just out of reach for now. There goes another toss. Got to be careful. Whoa, Deadshot! Is this a flash? Nay! Whoa! There's Viper with the long angle. What? And what they're up. that? They're up. Oh. My chum. Tell me. Tell me. What What? What are we witnessing here? I mean, this is a statement. Great. I don't know about you, but I am thoroughly impressed by Scooby's smoke push. I Maybe it's and because I haven't really casted the vet teams before, other than, other than Season 15. But that was... Uh, I'm speechless. That was actually really amazing, what I just saw there. This is what boss fight slash tutorial level... I don't think tutorial level does their... does their plays justice, because... This is boss fight that we're seeing here, ladies and gents. This is prime boss fight. You know, that we, we've got to understand that... Going against the team that is contending for... You know, world championship status you know last season and but boss fight are known for their glorious smoke pushes and to see them do that successfully on a map like subway but it's not even one of their best maps so right. i'm uh i'm thoroughly impressed to see them come back so quickly it almost makes me question have they been secretly scrimming and practicing like they said that they wouldn't <laughs> Let's, uh, wow. let's also not not discount NFI though. You know, they're they're only one point one point behind. They need to take this Marsoc ultimately. But for for boss fight, that's the Marsoc that they needed to take to win this map. And exactly. Does put NFI in a very dangerous position now. NFI needs to win this Everywhere. to even it back out. This is a lot. This is uh, almost too much to handle. For me, very much so. And what what are your what are your thoughts if you put yourself uh, into uh, uh, my shoes? Yeah. Uh, ah. Okay. Amos. Don't ask me that, <laughs> dude. <laughs> that's insane. Viper with a six-one KD. Okay, that's insane. A, a guy, the, ghost, that's the, the tabor has paid off for him clearly. <laughs> yeah. I mean, to throw yourself into NFI shoes, the the guy that's not played since season 11 exactly is, is now six and one against Off your fragment. team ridiculous is a uh, I, I it make me question what 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 am i doing wrong Man, that shot was right. maybe it's just boss fight C4, C4. ah boss fight huh? what what was that i heard c4 c4 but where's that c4 did you hear that? Yeah. Sorry to cut you off, Gray. That's a good question. So with it. No, 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 I'm just... Whoa, wait, you're patiently waiting for this basement push. Hoochie, side. dead shot. This is, this is... This is clear NFI meta pushes and... Okay. Scoob. Okay. Maybe he's not ready for this. Just stay, stay where you are. Steve Watch out, there is a Steve Fall literally above there. Okay, we have a guy Fine. in the basement for sure. Alright, Deadshot calling out Scoob. 
And that clacker is at the ready. Whoa! Got what? Him, got him, got him, got him. So, so I got the guy opposite of me. Stay there. Yep. Somehow, mad. Did flick onto radar. There goes a nade Let from Legel. The flash catches nobody. Here comes the swing. A second. Here comes a flash. Doesn't get Legel. Trash can. Joe, knowing bad in there. Whoa. A good toss. This is boss fight. Look, Lejil knows he can't deal with this right now, so he'll duck out, wait for them to run into another line of his. It's all about the the crossfire lines with boss fight. We've got Nadu posted up into the west main. And maybe some would say it's a little too safe, but the boss fight meta was successful for a reason. Now NFI, Sogs, and Madhat are going to spend minutes trying to clear the southern side of this overpass. And oh, three. Legio's just not there. Three under, three under. Look at Scooby. Headshot's ready for him. There it is! Headshot with the G36! There's three here, three here basement! What? Lonely! Coming out! There's no refrag! That shot cleans up Scooby. Oh my gosh. What gun is that from Viper? The Famas? Famas. <laughs> what? What are, we, what are we seeing here? Vibe. And the NFI guys are so split now. Two minutes on the clock. Right. Two minutes, ten on the clock. Madha does need to start making a move down on the north overpass here. Hearing Viper's shots and Sogs, is he ready to deal with Legil's position? I mean, look at the crossfire that Nadu and Legil have on one another. Viper and Scooby. Oh my. Talk to me, Chung. I don't know. I I'm legitimately speechless. I did not expect this at all from tutorial level. And I'm seeing things. I'm not used to casting people that move like this, that operate like this. I, I, the reason why I'm quiet is because I am trying to understand, and I'm struggling to. Here comes a rotation back from that. I'm sorry I'm so quiet. I legitimately don't know what to say. <laughs> legitimately don't know what to say. This is insane. The old timing, chum. Oof. Hunter I finds Viper. Him, him, that could be the pick that they need. One minute twenty on the clock, and Deadshot's rotating. Now he's gonna hear this. Do we see the push? Whoa, 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 whoa! Nard is getting shot at from Horseshoe South Overpass. Horseshoe. South Horseshoe, and here comes Legil. Legil's pushing! Does he hear the footsteps? The pre-fire, Sog shuts it down with the P90. The god comes back, roaring to life. Tutorial level, only one left. Oh my god, and the nade from Deadshot. No fun intended. Bring it 2-2. I don't know. I'm sorry, Gray. I'm not very... <laughs> I'm, not... I'm so quiet, but... This legitimately is blowing my mind. This is what I get, is... I guess, for not casting <laughs> before season 15, because my god, is this incredible. This is boss fight. I mean, for their defenses, they will rotate and almost let you run into another line of that. They, they understand the game to a point where they know that they can't deal with a situation, and they will accept that and allow themselves to drop off. They know that trades exist. They know that they're gonna get refragged, which will put their team at a disadvantage. So the likes of Lejil, Scoob, you know, we, we saw it with uh, Viper just then. The refragability and the rotational aspect of their defense is, is superb. And you know, it, it throws back to season 14 when th this is what they did in their prime. I'm surprised to see that them drop so quick towards the end, but I mean, this objective is notoriously hard to defend, in my opinion. So seeing both attacks go both ways, uh, uh, you know, we're, we're back to square one and to an interesting objective. This does does cater towards the cap and Scooby-Doo. I'm calling it chum. Folks, this is Chinatown. Um... 7-2 KD from Lonely Viper? Are you kidding me?
Um, yeah, we've got we've got a poll that went up, uh, and we're gonna see the we're gonna see the results of that in a moment. But uh, I want to get us started right away. This is round number five, and we are getting scary close to a tutorial level win, as long as they can lock in another Volk round. Uh, oh, sorry, this Marsoc round. Here we go, folks. What and if I really need to be careful for now is they're two two, and Scooby's notorious for his his moving smoke caps. He right. throws a smoke and he just holds it and crawls with the smoke to the objective. And if you're not privy to that, the likes of Raz Sogs who have not played against boss fight, you know, in the past seasons, that they're not going to know to pre-fight this. And Scoob can cap reliably in less than two seconds. Right. So. And they only need two points. And I think... I, I'm going to call it... I think we're going to see a cap from Scoob here. Uchi is lined up. As the main push... Begin their journey towards OBJ. Sogs tucked in neatly... Onto Triple X Alley. Here comes Hoochie versus Radar. Which he definitely hears this. Everybody hears this. AK-12. AK-5C, sorry. Here comes Legel. Just inching towards. I mean, this is, this is super important for Legel. And... Oh, what? There's that pop-up from Sogs. And Hoochie puts down some rounds. Good kill by Sogs, a pop-up. This tutorial level, Marsoc push here is going to struggle, and Scooby is the one to punish that aggressive push. Good refrag there, a smoke toss. I love these smokes. Look at this. Oof, oof. That one hurt, but Viper's still here. Heard that AK-12. May have even seen a muzzle flash. These footsteps, they're deadly. There's Hoochie with the second. Cleanup on the south alley. Good location. Here comes Scooby oh, no. finding those smokes. What's the prediction here? Scoob taking these smokes, and I I do think we're going to see a last ditch, ditch effort back? towards the main alley here. Knowing that two of your friendlies have just gone down to the triple X alley, you can't reliably push that. We have and a look, we're stacking up on smokes. Right. And a double frag here by Nardu. Double frag. And all of them have uh, the 100 mags from the LSW. So this is going to be interesting. We're 100% going to see a do ditch effort here, chum. Uh, <laughs> objective is going to be smoked in the next minute, and we either see a cap or an NFI defense. How about the next second? Because look at that. Ooh, nade toss over. Ah, yeah, oh, bad nade, bad nade. Nardu has only one piece of utility left, and that's one nade. And look at all these lasers onto objective, chum. Yeah. It's really tight. Security is locked in right now. And if I know what they're doing, uh, that's all I'm going to say. Yeah. They're petrified at this cap coming out. They have control of the South Alley to OBJ. So all they're focusing on is... Oh, I, I guess they know that... Wait, sorry. Let's just break this down. They are so confident that it's... Oh, yeah. Deadshot is saying keep watching North. But who's who's watching North? Now it's Mad Hatter. Just as Scoob and Nadu start... Ooh. And Here's that smoke from Scooby. Careful now. They do pull out. That's a need. A flash and a need! There goes Scooby going down! Nardu! That's a second nade to confirm. It's all up to Nardu. And those shots are just going mad. Mad Hatter finds the shot through the smoke. Three points for no fun intended. No fun intended. Expecting 
exactly what we just predicted there, Chum. You know, boss fight were going to go for that cap. But we saw three, four lasers at some points on, on that corner. And a scoot did throw those smokes in, a bomb and nades, which got those got those confirms. Can tutorial level successfully hold this defense is the question. They do need this Marsoc, you know, next round. So they, they need to win this Volk and then a Marsoc to take this map. Tutorial level showing impressive ability and execution here on Subway, but clearly no fun intended. Their current and consistent experience on it is 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 riding out, and uh, it does seem that even though there are, are some <laughs> tricks up tutorial levels sleeves, NFI is just coming out on top, just like that. Hatter picking Lonely Viper. It might be aim, it might be experience, it might be familiarity with the maps. Um, but yeah, tutorial level, you cannot underestimate them right now because they are way too deadly. Way too deadly. So when we talk about next round, Chum, yeah. if I have a possible two spawns, they can get the same spawn that tutorial level did or alternatively get the north one. And right. it does really impede a a southern push, you know, if you get the north. And I can predict full well that tutorial level is going to take advantage of that. We do see the south spawn by an open intended also. Let's go for it, folks. Round number six. Are you locked in, Gray? Because uh, this uh, is where I'm tutorial level my could... Seat, this is where tutorial level could turn things around. South spawn from no fun intended. Here we go, folks. South push by no fun intended. Four, four players. Raz taking the six o'clock, and here comes Viper. Ooh, the shots go out. That need. Watch that need. Ooh, Hoochie somehow lives. And Lonely Viper tucks back near the columns. And Look at this on radar. Suggs crawling down the north alley. Going to get spied by radar if he's not careful here. His shoulder, way, way too exposed. <laughs> what? Don't say what. Acknowledge it or don't. Careful, Radar. Here comes Sogs. Their feet might be exposing first. They do get the down of the confirm with the AK-12. A good pick on overpass. I don't know what to think here for NFI. The brunt and of the push is, is coming from here. Oh, this is going to take ages. This is default boss fight strats. Jeez. You know, if you don't know that Radar plays there, then you haven't done your homework. Right. And... Maybe, maybe NFI weren't expecting boss fight to come back. And are we seeing another radar flank here? Is my question. He, he seems like he's on his toes. Uh, radar is moving down overpass, but this is the focus here. NFI do decide to push the triple X, and radar is quite a bit away from flanking them and shooting them from the back, but. What's your prediction here? I mean, do you see a C4 here somewhere, Gray? If they decide to push Triple X Alley, then you know, this refarg ability right, of Nadu and Lajil is going to be key. Radar is on the right. Oh my, sure. Chum on the move. You're right. No, we can't. We can't ignore him anymore. We can't ignore him. It's What's Raz looking at? Because that's the. Oh no, Raz is involved. It's a two-two here. They... Two-two push here. Radar could get this two pick here. On main. Oh, this How are you going to learn? I, I, they really need to learn from their mistakes. Do not let Radar run around you. This is... This is a master at the works, here, Chum. I mean, he's he's done it for many seasons, and... So he punished them once. Don't let him fool you again. I don't see a clacker in people's hands. Legel is watching the tunnel. Is it Lonely Viper? I did hear a G36 from Lonely, so there could be a clacker there. There is a clacker, but Gray, find me that C4, because we need to know. We need to know where it's going to go. Where it's going to go. 
Why are we looking at you? On triple X. There goes Nardu with the call out. Somehow identifies the two here. Mad Hatter has a nade. Nada. There's the nade. But it's not no. the hint. Nardu's good. Nardu's good. Really need to stop peak. What? Good pick. C4 goes nowhere. Lonely. Oh, gets shut down again. This time Hoochie takes the one. Radar. Coming from the back. I think we're going to see a 2K here. One! Where's the 2K? Mad Hatter runs to cover. So does Radar. He's tied in. Radar, back on the move. Is Rams going to be ready for this? Oh, no. I think tutorial really levels are getting to too comfortable. <gasps> Raz has no idea. Go, Radar, go. Oh, no, Radar. Raz is tucked in. Raz is going to hear the footsteps. Rad Radar's going to go down. There it goes. Good pick by Raz. It's all lift up to Scooby. If anyone can do it, Scoob. And do we see a C4 set up here? Find me that C4, because this is this is gonna where it's gonna go down. Scooby's gotta be careful. Mad can't find this angle. Ooh, Mad does see this. Free fire through. Scooby's got locked. Is locked in. Nate! Flash! Will it catch Scooby? It does catch Scooby. A double flash. Scooby's pushing out. They don't want to be capped on, and there goes Deadshot cleaning up four points for NFI against Tutorials 2. Um, I don't know. I think we need to contact uh, the game devs because if that was the tutorial level, um, I don't like what's going to come afterwards. <laughs> I mean, Subway, you know, one of the more complex maps, but enjoyed by the majority in the league. And to see them go toe to toe with NFI in their first first week back in God knows how long, it's. It was impressive. I mean, for some of these players, you know, scores on the doors. We see Viper with seven and four, not played competitively since 2021. You know, he's going toe to toe with the likes of Atta, you know, six and one on the opposition. Yeah, big KDs. Very, very impressed. Very big KDs on the board, folks. That was map number one. Tutorial levels, map pick Subway goes to no fun intended, four to two. But we still have got two maps left. Don't go anywhere. I swear it's going to get even better. My name is Chummy. My co caster 24 Gray. We'll be right back.
keyboard lovers. I'm Vermal. Update 1.14 offers a sparkly new bazaar, where it's our familiar favorite medium range map, but with some refreshed textures and some in-game objects and map design. Market stall drapes have been given a haircut. They're shorter and enable better visibility into second floor of Kia. The beloved ice cream truck is no more. A bigger, tarped truck has taken its place. The devs have added this interesting broken wall next to Kill Room. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Round number one of map number two, Suburbia. Boss fight, or tutorial, oh my gosh. Tutorial level starting <laughs> off on defense on the semi-truck OBJ. Nardu, American player, pushing up on mid. A big lane four push. Welcome back, 24 gray. And hey, let's talk about tutorial level, as you said. Boss fight for a little here. Th this map, age old in the lower run with Sogs. Massive pick onto Viper there. I just died from that. That guy was dead for a second and then I... Completely interrupting my, my law, <laughs> but... <laughs> I Boss fight, a quickly... No, sorry, no, tutorial no. level, a quickly... Well, I'm gonna do that way too often. I'm gonna understand exactly what NFI are doing here. Scooby already radioing this smoke cross. Look, look at this rotation. They know what's up. I'm rotating wide. I'm rotating wide a to cover. Dangerous push by NFI. Sending everyone? We could see a multi-kill by, by Scooby here. We really could, because everybody is standing up. Everybody is crossing. Scooby, are you ready for this? Here comes the TCU. Do everyone's flash. Scooby, are you going to push? Let's smoke, Dawes. What is Scooby doing? Stop. Oh, no. It yields nothing. Oh my gosh, a flash onto everyone. And it all goes down the drain. Especially a lane four cross for this objective. It's it's pretty a meta. Fire, you know, if you this. really bombard lane one, you're covered by most of the fences towards objective. Radar had posted one up on the right? building one perch here. Just allow them to have the north. You know, they can't cap from there. They mm -hmm. are literally no danger at all to the objective. Just tuck in and wait for them to cross that road. You know, they have to cross it at some point. Radar, I'm watching in front of you. Watch your side. Legil might be in a bit of trouble here. Maybe oh! Fanucci a shot. Might have gotten one of the Only a down. There's the revive. Five up from no fun intended. Legel is definitely know, in the Gucci. hot seat. That was a hell of a shot. Wow. I don't even know where he fucking was. <laughs> oh, there goes Legel. It's Raz who one. actually found him. Hoochie said he had no idea where he was. And here comes Sog with the P90. Nardu's not going to... What? He finds through the blind fire. It's all lift up to radar. Finding one. Can he find the four? And he's pinched now. Had a trained in. You got Sogs. Does he know? Absolutely brilliant blind fire with the P90 yeah, yeah, from Sogs. It's now left up to Radar, who hears these voices, American and British. They don't know where Radar's position oh, is. Oh gosh! Flash? I don't think anybody oh, saw him. Hatter. Hatter's. Hatter's caught. Here comes Hoochie. They, making their way. They seem to be a bit stumped here. Radar not ready for this. Echo one on the tablet. Oh! There's that swing and no. Little too aggressive. I think we gotta roll back the replays and literally just watch Sogs do that again. Because that was mind-blowing. We gotta Are see you? that again. Hold on, folks. Wow. Give us a second. Look at this. All right. Ignore this. But did you see that gray, or was that just me? You saw that blind fire? Through the fence. Through the fence. It, it's testament to plays knowing the meta meta positions. What? Like a headshot. Did you see that? It was purely. 
purely instinctual, just out of nowhere. Out of the blue, a little flick to the right, and somehow it actually got, and, and can we just break that down? Scooby flashed all of them, all of them. I'm sorry, I, I cannot ignore that. We, we do see tutorial level get the summon spawn, and I think we are going to see quite a different attack from tutorial level here. They they know somewhat what the, the meta is in terms of a defense, and I, I fully expect Viper on the pre-fire. Nope. No pre-fire. MK17. It's a fork. It's a four times. Here comes Nardu. They did get flash from Raz. And uh, okay, great. Thank you, game. <laughs> they get flash. A pre-fire with the MK18. Doesn't yield them anything. Wait, what is that? Is that the what? Oh, it's a it's the hundred mag. I didn't know it fit on the MK18. Did you know that? I didn't. I believe it fits if it's a few guns. Legil! on Huji. That's their lane four opened. Are we gonna see a familiar smoke cross? Whoa, Nardu Whoa. goes down. Romeo, Romeo. A good toss from lane two, but here comes the radar. Is contesting lane four with a buddy. Yep, and with that, they've just announced their presence. What a need. And Nadu now providing valuable information to the rest of his team. Raz, position not known as yet. There goes that revive and Sogs. We'll hear these these voices. Raz is in a great position. But it's just potential. Nothing has been confirmed. Scooby. Pushing on to mid. Sogs, do you hear that? Nope, they push on to lane three. Deadshot calling out smokes on OBJ. Who's next in line? Who's going to get fragged here? They really need to find that pick onto Hada. If they, if they can kill Hada, then all the yeast is free at tutorial level. Scoop! Double smoke. Counter smoke. Legit seed is where that smoke comes from. Ooh, got to be careful with the no fun intended. Blind fire trade between Nardu and Raz. Oh, and there goes Legil down on lane four. It's Lonely Viper trying to snipe, and Scooby manages to find the kill onto lane three. Mad Hatter is down, but Gray, can they find this point? One, uh, 2v2. In a 2-2 situation now, Viper, it all comes down. Can Viper find Deadshot? Deadshot gets a bit too peaky. Yeah. Sogs in the open here. Not an objective. Find Scoob on the cross. Viper going for it. Deadshot doesn't see him. He's going to make tough possible? work of that 4x. That's it's a big gun for a small map. Yeah, Deadshot didn't see him. Got all the time in the world. Plenty of time. That shot still trained in. Does crawl does call the potential crawl cross lane four. He is aware of that risk that is now that the north attack from Viper. Does he expose himself too much to Viper's forex? <laughs> I mean, ev everyone that knows Viper, he is he's the god of sniping. He is the de facto. So, let's see if he can do some work with it. That trade between Nardu and Raz does yield the last tutorial level player standing, uh, flashing a nade. And what what can they can what what can Viper do with that? Apart from the forex, I think a nade. Onto Deadshot's position, that's a really common spot at this point. But is tutorial level aware of it after the map changes? 
and this is it, Chum. Viper been out of the game so long. Right. His skills are definitely there, but maybe map knowledge not so much. And right. been a lot of time here, one minute forty on the clock, and not really gain much ground. Does need to find that pick around the one minute mark. Suggs is just going to have a field day. You know, he's got to push objective at some point. Suggs on mid lane is, is available for that rotation onto OBJ. But uh, that's what Lonely Viper's utility is for. They do have a nade, and they do have that flash. So after they do maybe get a pick onto Deadshot, flash into that area south to OBJ, could go out. Sogs could fall into that. We may see a cap, but that's that's a far-fetched and... Um, I remain right in five seconds. It's, he's making it more difficult. About a second. Hearing shots from Deadshot, position known. It's going to hear these beeps now, and we're going to see a panic. Yep, 30 seconds. Here, Here he goes. Comes. Here's that flash. Careful Great pyro. Yourself. Won't catch Deadshot, though. Deadshot is perfectly hidden. There's the pre-fire by Deadshot. Won't catch anything. No call out from Sogs. Sogs somehow downs themselves. Where's Viper? What is Viper doing? What? Whoa! Viper manages to catch Deadshot. A headshot with the MK-17. Look at this. Absolutely brilliant. But Sogs is there to punish. 2-0 right now for NFI. Miraculous. I mean, as we said during the break, it shows tutorial level they are rusty but look they have got some firepower right now that um i don't think any of us quite expected maybe even the team didn't expect this firepower and we're, we're kicking a 2v1 a 1v1 situation in the end there it could have gone anyway Viper, maybe a little too overly cautious. Did want to clear Mad Hat's spot first, which you know, did eat up a lot of his time. But you know, 1v1, you can't discount the fact that he did do some work with that 4x, and right. unfortunately, Sogs did have that refrag. And great time wasting by the NFI guys that they knew roughly the correct echo. Um, let's see how they can attack the red car level on defense. Second OBJ of map number two is on red car. Katie's up on the board. Any predictions for this? I think tutorial level, I think they've, they're knocking off some of the rust and I think they're, they might find a Volk round here, but no fun intended. With each round passing by, they seem to be winning and they seem to be getting used to uh, tutorial level's uh, understanding of the map. You have a strong lane one and two push by no fun intended. No and early util from no, uh, from uh, Tutorial. We can see this adaptation, actually, by Tutorial level, knowing that they did a quite heavy 4-slash-5-man rush right. across to the north. Look at this rotation by Nadu and Radar. You know, the objective's on the complete opposite side of the map. Right. And I do think Tutorial level are feeding this into their strat plans now. They... They know what the meta is, and they're quickly realizing NFI's, NFI's game plan. Radar, we'll hear these footsteps on mid lane from Deadshot, as well as the voices there lane one. So this is contentious. If Radar will reveal that this is a multiplayer push here, we could see an aggressive push by Lonely Viper, but I don't know if that's the kind of player Viper is. There's the call out from Raz. They will watch the flank, and exactly, they understand the weakness 
of this four-player push. I think what we're going to see here, chum, is the smoke while Will come out by NFI and Nadu. Exactly the same as what we saw with Scoob is here to shut that down. Let's make a 12 shots going out from lane three, but no one's there. Oh my gosh, Radar's actually moving. Radar wants to flank around lane two and come at him out as a prize. We do see crosshairs from Raz and a friendly. Radar is going to tuck in neatly. I'm going to put one right here. They are investing in this. Yep, here we go, folks. Five of NFI. Posted up John Lane one. Nardu with the long shot. Blind fire through the smoke. Catches nobody, but Matt Hatter did tag him. There goes that call out. Lane two identified. Look at this smoke. Radar, when are you pushing? Everybody's focused on the push. How many smokes is that? Can you count them all? Got six smokes. Oh my, my counter. gosh. Bad smokes. I'm going, I'm going. Massive hole. Big hole, big Adam. hole, big hole. Radar might find this. Radar doesn't find it. It's too quick. Lane three called out, but Mad Hatter is not quite right. They're not going to be ready for Radar's position here. Ooh, misses Miss? two. Here goes he gets Radar. Through? What? Oh, okay. I thought that was a, a self nade. Viper, radar. Here's the on call. The flank. Out. No, no, no. Find intended. They're calling out. Watch out for the flank. They are prepared. Oh, they find one. Oh, Mad Hatter shuts it down though. Quick refrag. For Viper. Past the halfway mark, and no fun intended. To have such an incredible position here. Viper is lane two. Is no fun intended. Expecting a second flanker here. Is that the tutorial level um, strategy? 4v4. What do you do if you're NFI now? You're, you're stuck in between a rock and a hard place. You can't cross that reliably. Yeah. Viper trained yeah. into that north cross. You know, if someone decides to push that. Yeah. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We're seeing Raz here, though. Look at the coordination by the NFI guys. Lasers, the cross lines. Do we see this rotate by Viper? It can seem tempting. And just like that, yin and yang, lonely. Viper tucks in to mid and Raz pushes out to their to their previous angle. One minute thirty. There goes Nardu called out. Raz identified as well. Here comes a cross. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, big this flash. We'll catch Raz. And Scooby goes down to Mad Hatter once again. There's Sogs with a pick of their own. Oh, no. Viper has been identified. Big call out. Are we going to see a, a rotation? Because Hoochie can hear these footsteps if Viper gets too close. One minute ticking. No fun and ended. Are four up. Here comes Lonely. Ooh, just misses. Oh, Legel finds Mad Hatter. A big... Needed refrag, the top fragger for NFI. And here comes Viper. May catch Raz. Oh no, Raz. Oh, oh there's the headshot. Beautiful. Oh, Bringing it down to a 2v2. Legel putting in some work. 2v2. 30 seconds remaining. Okay. Viper spots Sogs. And they just need to play time. Legel. Oh, there's Hoochie. Him. Oh, Viper might get tagged again. The feet, they'll go down with the P90. It's a one on two. Legel, it's all left up to you. 20 seconds. Can they even put out a cap this quick? Here they come. Legel will hear footsteps very soon from, from St. Sogs. They've just got to stay disciplined. Here comes Sogs. Hoochie. Here comes Hoochie. Hoochie's pushing. Oh, my God. Sogs. Man. Brutal. Eight. Six and one from Sucks. Wow. I mean, you can understand that. Look at that. Swing and a kill. No, no fun intended. 3-0 right now. 3-0. Boss fight. Tutorial level. Never discount. Never discount them, but they are... They're bringing it down to the wire. They just can't claw.
the last few players have no pun intended now they've got to attack this and we're taking out the adjacent objective on the white car when just two rounds ago where we might see it become a close close 1v1 again we do just have don't think we do have a dono that I want to shout out really quick Sorry to interrupt you, Gray. Taramatsu donating uh, 1,000 yen. Thank you so much. And uh, believe it or not, we just briefly had nearly... We, we actually had 61 concurrent viewers. 60? 61. Wow. That's beyond Breacher's numbers. So thank you all for tuning in and supporting uh, these teams. It's an absolute blast casting them here tonight. And um, yeah, right now, no fun intended. They are really coming up ahead. But uh, tutorial level has given us quite the show. Free fire by Mad Hatter, and that will suppress tutorial level from crossing. Viper is actually daring. Hey, fairly similar defense to NFI's previous. Yeah. Are they going to learn from those mistakes? Wow. Folks, only down. Radar, are you ready? Here comes a flash. No one nade. It goes too far. Radar's still here. Here comes Scooby from their left. Free fire through. There's Radar. Finds the kill. A good one. 4v4. Hey, 4v4. Top fragger down in the first 50 seconds. But hey, Mad Hatter's still up. Folks, up for cross. Look at that beautiful flash by Deadshot. Big coverage there, and Gray, it's another smoke wall. Why are they doing this? It's, it works, it works. I'm unsure why, but it definitely, definitely works. They gotta be careful of Deadshot's position here. Very vocal, may find the children, but careful. Here comes another two smokes. That's a flash, the second one. Deadshot does get caught. Scooby's marooned inside on the middle. Deadshot will hear these footsteps. No, maybe not. Somehow, Scooby gets away with it. He slips by. Ray finds Raz. What? Oh, my. What are we seeing here? Where was Raz? Lane 2? Lane 2 yeah, North? Yeah, but posted, posted up on the, on the concrete pillars. Oh, my God. Building 2 here. No fun intended to find a, a point on the board. Here now. Oh, my God. Unfortunately, all smokes, all util, were wasted on that cross. What? Uchi, that four X. Uchi goes down, and, and Scooby's on the swing. Mad Hatter will definitely hear these shots. No, it's radar that right, finds the kill. Chum, I said, never, never discount boss fight. Tutorial level, a clean attack win. Are you folks? I do you have your seatbelts on because <laughs> this <laughs> matchup in. is going too fast for my comfort. Oh my gosh. Next OBJ, we have to talk about it right now, Gray, unless you want to break that down, break that round down. No, I mean, we we saw a boss fight learn from their mistakes. You know, they, they almost knew where the NFI players were going to play to right. a point. They ID'd Sogs. That was a refrag. The ID dead shot. That was a refrag. Right. And then after that, it was just chaos. Viper. Yeah. You know, yeah. tutorial level took control, and that that spot fight, they take control of these situations. Looking at the new objective that we've got here in center yeah. house, it's it's an OG objective. Boss fight know how to defend this successfully. Because if I don't need a cap. So I don't think we're going to see a rush play. But, you know, boss fight are trained in this objective. And if they can hold this, it's, it's highly capable. Yeah. It's highly capable. And every one of those players can cap under two seconds. So it, if we do see it go to a 3-2, mm -hmm. I think boss fight are just going to throw everything at the wall and hopefully it sticks. My gosh. 
I just want to go over the KDs. 7-2 from St. Sogs, a 5-3 from Radar. Matt Hatter with a 5-3 as well. This is where it matters um, for no fun intended. If they fumble this, like we've seen so many teams fumble these kinds of, uh, these kinds of scores, uh, we may see a big, big upset. And it will be upsetting too. Here comes tutorial level defending mid OBJ. Getting the west spawn does cater towards a more aggressive push. Sogs gets down from my ring. That's a big pick. This rush completely locked down. Dead shot there to support. Completely halted. I mean, Top Fragger is down two rounds in a row. Right. You know, less than 30 seconds each time. Are we going to see a repeat of last round? Pats' position is known now by Viper. Oh my gosh. Viper's really close. But so is Uchi. Defense. There it is. Nardu. Uchi goes down. Big pick onto lane four. Ay, ay, ay. Not good for NFI. They may need to try again. 3v5. They may need, they may need to try again to lock this map down. Not a good start at all. It might be outside we of so really, really got to find some picks. Left. Had a confirming his own teammate here. Yeah. And a five. Are we no, no, are we stumbling? Not. What a too much noise is being made. Viper, flashing hand. Oh my gosh. Ooh, if they flash oh, right, they could find both. Ooh, but Scooby. Oh. Oh, here comes a flash, and Deadshot is caught out. Big pick, and the pre-fire by Lonely Viper yields nothing. Mad Hatter is still up. It's up to him and Raz to recover this. 2v5. 2v5. Incredible. Here comes Show Lonely Viper at the bottom of lane one. Oh, it's Legel, not Scooby. I apologize. That was peeking the window. Here comes Viper. What? What? here is this is this the same team that played two rounds ago chum what are we watching they they're steamrolling a 5v1 radar it does Raz go down to to look at nardu look at nardu hot off the tail raz luckily does rotate back down to north and just like that tutorial they have full map control they cannot pierce the halfway point. Nardu in the east. Lonely Viper in the west. And two up on the OBJ. Oh man. What do we what do you do if you're Raz now? You know okay, you got one kill. Maybe your team did refrag. Yeah. But you look at your tablet and you see that one lonely green dot. And you have to contest. This team that's that's just taken so many points for being you know, so rusty out the gate. Um, do we do we see Boss White taking this tutorial taking this and see it go to a two three? A two and three, I, I think this, uh, yeah. this rush cap. Two three could definitely happen. That rush cap can definitely happen. But right now, it all depends on whether tutorial level can ride out this wave that they're on right now really good momentum starting off here for round five again they've got to keep it going with that they've got to or else it's going all down the drain and this matchup will go to nfi lonely viper making a lot of noise can they cop a headshot no just out of cover and raz is beat is beautifully stealth walking something that tutorial level have clearly been missing out on not being able to do so here comes viper may pop out legil as well i was playing this perfectly what Pyro. no viper, no. viper definitely saw that here comes the swing and they find it beautiful oh but the nade oh my chum this yeah. is a spectacle yeah. i yeah. mean for for good reason the guys at home have got good taste you all wanted <laughs> to see this cast. What was it? Like 27 votes?
Correct. And 28. We had 61. 28 votes, and we had 61 peak concurrent viewers. Right. I mean, share this with the rest of the community because what you're watching live right now is something you will never see again. This is this is special. Tutorial level, you know, we, we've been over it a few times now, but off the bat, you know, this is their first match in six months. Some of the players haven't played in since 2021, a few years. Right. And this is their no scrims, no practices. This is their first league match. This is back a to big onward. deal. Yeah. And they're contesting against NFI, the second EU champions last season. They were contenders for world championship. You know, th this is a statement. I want to call out the KDs once again. Viper with a 6-4. Twos across the board, apart from Radar with another 6-4. 7-3 from St. Sogs. And Hoochie with the donut. I, I mean, that's that's a big... I think they're bleeding here in a fight from, from being able to swiftly get rid of this Suburbia and move on to map three. They're bleeding. and But, but tutorial level, they're also rising to the occasion themselves. It's incredible. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it, Chum. They really need to find these early picks. NFI right. are going, as you said, going to bleed. And especially they got the e spawn now. Yeah. That's right. Surreal level are gonna be looking for this cap. They know that if they don't get this, they've got to contest another vault round and seeing how some of these objectives are quite problematic. They might as well try and block it out right now. We, we do see the extension onto lane four, and let's see how NFI deal with that. Here they come. Free fire through. Hoochie tries it again. No luck. Tutorial. Big push onto lane four, but that's not where No Fun Intended is even worrying about. They're here, lane one, two, and mid. What is this? I uh, This is really strange. You tell me, because you're, you're the EU player. This is strange. This is NFI not trying to get capped on, chum. Right. Look at oh, Sons' wow. position. Yeah. Completely exposed to Surely. the slide. Right. They're, they're all on objective here. They've given up so much of the map. They do not want to get capped on. Negative. There's no one to snipe right now. And I don't know if this is the right move. They may have avoided... I mean, they may have preemptively defended that tap attempt, but clearly tutorial level have not taken that route at all. At all. They're just well, too he self-aware. He's there's no refrag available. The Jill now choosing to join him. This this extension in into the east is gonna pay dividends. No, no one's looking out, chum. They they're just I don't want to say a bit startled. Mm -hmm. I mean, I would. But they're just not one to get capped on, it seems, from this defense. Sox has a very kind of uncomfortable angle, and we do see another crosshair from Deadshot inside the house, cutting through to lane two, but it's up to Nardu to do something here. Not sure and what's going to yield. Lane one. Raz could get fragged they out by radar in just a second. I mean, Suggs is completely open to the east. There it goes. Anything down. Line four, line four, line four. Oh, there's the... What a double by Deadshot! Lane four is dead. They don't even know that was a double. This is, this is it. Tutorial level, how can they pick up the pieces? It's a two on five. I think Deadshot, this... I think this defense worked out great for him. Yeah, and look at the lasers now. Oh, the defense bye bye. is up. No, need. <laughs> bye bye, Sogs. 4v2 now. Suddenly winnable. I don't know if this is winnable. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm, it's because I'm the imposter in this. I've seen it before, and if anyone can do it, you know, Scoob's your man. Three oh minutes on the gosh. clock. They got all the time to play with here, Chum. Oh Dead my gosh. Deadshot's angle. The timing. Oh. Scoob and uh, Mad Hatter actually just missing each other. 
Barely. Scoob checking the code. Yeah, and that's impressive. Lajel needs to find his on pick smoke, onto Raz. Smoke onto Raz. Beautiful. Another Isn't smoke onto Hatter. Oh my gosh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Careful, careful. Good frag, Lajil, good frag. Did you see him? Lajil! They did say smoke on enemy on the smoke, and Lajil does find it eventually. It's a two on three. Scoob's inside! Stop! Francis. Stop it! What's going on? What? Oh my god, it's a two on two! Somehow, tutorial level, they're making it happen. What's is, that clacker? Is this a play? Both now on top of objective. Perfect oh, smoke. Dead shot spotted. Dead shot spotted. Good smoke onto OBJ, and it's a trade. Somehow, it's a one v one. What the party? A one v one situation. I told you, chum. If anyone can do this, it's a nade from Scooby. Scooby can have this. It's a nade from Scooby. Scooby can have this. Oh my god. Oh, very close. Not quite. Good try. Deadshot with the nade of their own. No luck. One minute 15. He really needs to gather that util. He really needs to gather that util. Move your way up those stairs. Dead shot. Very, very peaky. One sliver, and Scoob's got it. Fifty-seven seconds remaining here, chum. You know what? Well, I don't even know what we're watching anymore. It's the this KD. Just... It, they don't know the KD, so we're absolutely get uh, our our guts are being ripped apart. By the tension, neither of these two remaining players in Suburbia know it's a 1v1. But they're trying to make it work. Scoob, here's that clacker, that ticker on the, the radio, and 20 seconds remaining now. He's really got to do something. But Deadshot's in plain view. Deadshot's completely exposed. Scoob could find this. Come on, Scoob. Oh, Bring this to us round seven. Here's Deadshot. Whoa, rotates away. Oh, my God. Out of nowhere. Scooby saves the day into a 3-3 on Suburbia. Slot this through, chum. A 4v2 situation. Legil and Scoob, I called it. If anyone can do it, it is Scooby. Oh, <laughs> my <laughs> Somehow, Deadshot just cannot get away. We can't call them tutorial level anymore. I don't think it's allowed. <laughs> it's, it's not allowed. It's, <laughs> it's fight. What are you watching? This is, again, I can't wrap my head around it. The guys that were the second in EU championships, they were championship contenders. And boss fight are making it look easy some rounds. Some rounds, free, yeah, free. easy, yeah. One v five, that's brutal. Let's get that poll up, chum. Who, who do we up, think? Up. <laughs> who do we think is gonna take this? Because, oh man, I, I, I don't think my heart can take this, you know. Especially <laughs> seeing Boss Fight go from the up and the ups and downs, and if, if anyone can do it, it's Boss Fight. Bringing that back from a free zero. I've asked you this before, but. What's going through your head if you're an NFI member right now? I don't know, but you know what I do have is some a medical recommendation for you. Pull out, pull out that margarine, 24 gray, because you're gonna need that. <laughs> oh, that. <laughs> <laughs> you're oh, gonna yeah, need yeah. that. We were talking about butters from around the world <laughs> and cheeses, and we were talking about margarine. And I think you're gonna have to get 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 an, uh, keep an eye on that cholesterol level for you. Pull is up, my friends. This is it. The last OBJ on Playground. Ladies and gentlemen, this is round seven. NFI versus No Fun Intended. Somehow they have brought it out of nowhere. Here we go. Pre-fire through That's to right. the quick spawn in the west. Gray, predictions quick. Look at this angle from Legil. Oh, it's brutal. They could find Deadshot no if they peek a boot. Oh, gosh. 
no one expects this, especially the size difference. Let's talk about let's talk about the size difference that you're getting on with. Because not many games actually replicate the mechanics of your player height is actually the size in which you are real life. So right. Legil can see over that bus. Or see through the windows at least. Not many players can. And maybe that's an off angle for him. A need! That's a precision strike that was off by just a meter. And look at that. Look, look at this beautiful angle Scoob. from Deadshot. Could find, could decapitate Scooby here on, on OBJ if they do Does peek out. the cap from behind the hedges is still a thing? Yeah, cap behind the hedges is no longer a thing, Scooby, but they can't hear us. No tutorial level, it's all up to them. Radar on Vocals. This is a power position. Gray, what's the potential of this? Mad Hatter is is uh, weary, though. Especially this attack. Radar's got overwatch of all of it. Viper cutting down the lane two push. You know, they they understand the meta play. Scoob, gonna walk into Deadshot's line of fire here. Oh, and a trade. oh good trade, good trade, good trade. 4v4. Let's whittle this down to another 1v1. They're, they're not ready for first Viper and Radar. I don't often see this position played. Locking down that lane free push now does give Viper some comfortable rotations. Sogs. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Here comes Mad Hatter. Is Hatter ready for this? Oh, no. I mean, as long... Oh, Viper! What? Viper wins at the headshot with the FAMAS! Sogs, hear that! A 3v4 situation, boss fight, tutorial level on top. A beautiful nade. nade! Oh my gosh, Sogs! Stop it! 3v3. Get out of here, says Sogs. Get back to the lobby, Viper. Uh oh, Legil might get his toes cut off. Legil cannot I think see he's, Raz. He's covered by the wheel. Yeah, yeah, but briefly, uh, I'm pretty sure Raz saw a little toe or two. Oh! Here comes Legil! They want the pick! No, they tuck back in. Good play, good play. Here comes a nade. Here comes a nade. Oh, beautiful! No! Oh my gosh! Get the, frick out of here, man. get the frick out of here is right. It's up to Hoochie to get so this fun. revive. Sogs approaching. Ooh, Raz is tilted. Raz is tilted. I, I would be too. I would be too. Sogs, what is this play? Could we see a cap here? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my gosh! Oh, Barnardu goes down! Sogs' position has been revealed. There goes a kill on the Legend and Raz! It's a 1v2! Sogs, do you have it in you? Start crashing, buddy! They're not ready for Sogs! He's still alive! Here He's comes dangerous. Radar. Sogs might hear this. I mean, is wide open? Uh, OBJ is completely open. The Sogs. Completely open. In him. Radar! Completely cuts off the angle now. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Relax, Radar, relax. Where are you going? Radar, where are you going? Boss fight tutorial level. Oh my gosh, Legil! What is Legil doing? No way! Tablet is out! 3v3! Radar nowhere to be seen, and Sogs punches in the seven digits, locking in five points for no fun intended on Suburbia. The Masters wow. go down with a heavy fall. I mean, what a close round. We, we ought to say, Chum. I mean, NFI take the series, but you know they take the points. But who takes the, who takes the heart of the viewers? And wow, tutorial level. That was a real masterclass. I don't know what to say. Legil, absolutely. Oh, look at Viper going down like that. Viper knew what was coming to him. They must have seen or heard that frag in the air. Right now, the vote, it's 52% to NFI, 48% to tutorial level.
We're right back at. Oh, we hit a new peak. 65 viewers. Great. 65. In onward, I, that's unheard of. Unheard of. Wow. And uh, third map. Third map. Can we see boss fight? Claw. At least one back. Folks, thank you for tuning in with us. We're going to let these replays roll. My name is Chumbe, my great co-caster. Uh, I don't know. Thank you so much for being here with me. 24 <laughs> Gray. We're here in map three. NFI, the official winners. But we're going to see some hot onward action off the press on map three. We'll be right back. All right, give me... Uh-oh. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. That was map two, but here we are, map three. Bizarre. Tank OBJ. Tutorial level starting us off here on Marsoc. No fun intended defending. Welcome back. My name is Chumbe. My co-caster with me, 24 Gray. On a legendary matchup here tonight, bringing us some of the most incredible plays I've seen so far. Amazing work from both teams, but NFI have officially won this matchup 4-2 on Subway, 5-3 on Suburbia. I mean, what a story, chum. We can just take take Suburbia alone and, you know, that tells a story in its own and is is worth, worth its weight in gold. I mean, I don't think tutorial level are too disheartened in losing their first week and pulling back so many points against yeah. NFI. Big. It really shows what a master tier team and they will be master you know quote me on this what 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 they're capable of and i'm not saying nfi slouched on them but some of it's not within your realm of control and boss fight tutorial level i, I don't know how we can see them as a tutorial level anymore no not at you all know, they, they, they are the boss fight against teams like nfi Oh, there goes down Nardu. They're on the south push. Raz, the very, Maybe one through very smoke common the... push. Uh, sorry, spot there on the broken wall. Good smoke, and here comes Viper. They want some meat. Good pre-fire through the penetrables of the truck. The bad thing is, is that Viper was completely exposed before they even saw that. <laughs> Good suppression there. No one opting to watch that cross. A very, very meta play. Instead, we see Sogs posted upon alert position. May find a few on the cross. Doesn't hit radar. Radar knows his position. Sogs not rotated. 
Oh, it's dead shot. That downs radar, but the one revive can still go out. Where's Ledjo when you need him? Does radar see soaks? No audio keys as of yet. Uh oh. Yeah, Viper could go down. I think Deadshot got tagged. Oh, the lag is insane. Yeah, 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 yeah. Radar does call out um, St. Sogs, and Legil should be ready. What? what? Just under he the barrels. Assume. No. Oh, Sog to find this. Oh, no. Radar. Wait. Oh. oh there's Sogs with a quick jiggle. Two here identified, and Radar is going to be challenged by Sogs. They are parallel to each other. Look at this. What are you doing, Radar? But no one's there, right? No one's there. A good flash, and it will catch Sogs, and Radar gets tagged by Raz before they could get the frag. Two on five. No fun intended. They're still here. They're, they're still here, and you, yeah. Okay. Well, then I team killed. I don't. Tutorial level. This is their pick, chum. They, they don't seem too comfortable on my side here. I don't think so. No. I don't know why, but this server is so... La it's always bizarre. Maybe the map. Oh, here comes Sogs. Ready for him. Good rotation. It's all left up to the one and only Scooby-Doo. If anyone can do it, it's Scoob. 5v1. Big ask. Ooh, M203. Where did that land? It landed perfectly. Denies Not Manhattan right, the, the view line, and there's Hochi. One point to NFI. Wow. I think I need to see a doctor or something. Um, my heart rate's too elevated right now. It's too elevated. This is gonna this is gonna be an interesting end to the story. Do we see NFI overpower tutorial level? You know, Maybe. they've already won. And realistically, what NFI need to look at now is maximizing their MMR game. We we've seen NFI have a few close matchups first by Fortis Redemption, mm -hmm. um, and then they played Imperial, which they lost to. So, being their third matchup, they will gain that MMR, uh, that MMR number or status this week, which will classify their even master tier, their diamond ranking. So, they need to gain as much MMR as possible, and by doing that, taking the more, taking more rounds will aid in that MMR um, addition. You know, that, that cap definitely helped, but yeah. the close rounds that we saw, 4-2, then a 5-3, it looks very close on paper, and that's what the MMR calculation really cares about. Really impressive stuff. Oh my god. I'm like trying to calm down. That was <laughs> the craziest suburbia I've ever casted. It's... The craziest suburbia I've ever casted. Wild. Just... What a story, Chum. A free yeah. zero on the verge of losing it. Right. And a masterclass by Scoob. And then also for NFI, Sogs, you know, the top fragger, to come back and claw the cat out of a 2v1 situation. Yeah. Maybe this is a tough lesson for tutorial level. Yeah. I think they you both know, you... assumed each other were covering the OBK. Yeah. I think that's what happened. Um, I'm speechless. I'm speechless. <laughs>
We were treated more than we deserve today, chum. 100%. Got, hey, you know, I said this in the caster's chat. This is history, right? And indeed it was. An incredible comeback from the boss fight players on their new roster tutorial level. They're not quite there at their former selves, but uh, I think, uh, no fun intended, they're going to be taking some notes. Because even at, basically, at, 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 their, at these players' as lowest, Radar, Legel, Nardu, Archer, Scooby, um, Viper, all of these players, they, have, they are able to teach quite a whole lot. They have still a lot left to offer. It's impressive. And I just cannot shake the feeling that I... That tutorial level, these players, they are very strange to me. I cannot shake that feeling that these players are incredibly different than any other team I've ever seen in cast. Which makes sense, right? Because I didn't cast before season 15, but I've, I've, I've seen enough of EU and these guys are really something else. Really. I, I, we, I, don't, I don't know what else to say. We are going to see a shake-up here. The one and only Archer has hopped into the server. Oh my. Let's see what punishment Archer can deal. We do have the north quick spawn, and there is a stack up there in the north. Hatter and plus one are making that cross with the smoke and that PKM. Wow, that lag is unreal. Jesus. And that PKM will be deadly. Radar and on the hunt here. Where's the radar? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. No, but they're talking back. Smoke. They're playing a little reserved. That smoke perfectly disguises Radar's cross. There goes Legel downed. Nardu was tagged. Radar has the potential to take out two right now. And Legil's just got free information at this point. Right. Scoob on the road safe for that revive. You gotta keep your eye on radar here. Yeah. This is dangerous. Am I here? Yes, I'm here. Okay. Look at that nade position. They still think he's posted up on the close side of purple. We don't know what you're talking about. Those are some weird callouts. Sorry. Outs. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> There's radar and archer going oh, at the okay. same time. Hey. Essential triple kill Look here? at Archer. Look at Archer. Look at Archer. Oh my god. But look at Radar. Three of them coming at him behind him. The trigger discipline. Radar has all of this. Three. Three voices into Rad Radar's headset here. Oh no. Raychar turns their back on uh, Raz. They have no idea that Raz is here despite the audio cues. Oh my gosh. Deadshot could go down. Oh, the AK-12 misses. Callout goes Sons. out from Deadshot. Lag is Radar just lets him slip. Look at this trigger discipline. Oh. No, no, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. That's exactly right, Radar. Not yet. Let him get comfortable. Let him get comfortable. Oh, jeez. There's a double. And he hears Hada. Good call out oh, by Radar. Radar. Ooh, there it is. Whoa, but Hatter! He's dead, he's dead. Banks Jesus. it. Archer finds Seven Raz. Level. Finally, that kill goes out. A four on two situation. They've got this objective locked down. All incorrectly out onto the bottom side of Far East. Okay, I have one position and one not OBJ known. And one south. I'll never understand how master players call out one on me. 
Oh, there's the call out from Deadshot. Does identify the scaffolding rotation. Deadshot now locked. Archer. Just playing time. And this is what boss fight do so well. No overexposure. Right. It's not, it's they know the that they the got the man advantage from that radar call out. Echo free plus Archer's kill. They know what the echo is. They just gotta play time. Mad Hatter got tagged. DKM from Legel. Back up. That's In action. Here comes Deadshot. This. Flash out. Where's Hatter? Low health. That's some valuable information as well. They know Hatter and Deadshot's position now. Right. 1 minute 30 on the clock. Look at Archer's rotation. Beautiful coverage of the finish line onto OBJ. Though the Far East is exposed. And I'm not sure whether the tutorial level understands this. Now they do. Look at Archer's beautiful reposition. They have great coverage. There goes Scooby. Oh, it's Deadshot that finds him. Archer getting a bit too peaky here. Oh, Legel goes down as well. Scaffolding, scaffolding. 2v2. I think there's some bad yeah, call outs from Deadshot. I think that. No, scaffolding is still here. Headshot. Matt Hatter could go down. Don't peek that, Hatter. 2v2. Pick up your gun, Archer. Look at that headshot that's waiting for you right there. Oh, he misses with the AK 12. They drop down. Deadshot swings and finds Archer. There's the quick refrag from Nardu. It's a 1v1. Hatter may have the advantage here. He doesn't see him. Ooh, 30 seconds straight. 30 seconds. Nardu rotates back down to OBJ. Hatter could rotate to objective and cap. And but no, what do you do here? I would have gone just to cap he, if the co yeah. kill count was right. Here's Nardu. Nardu shoots again. Baits a rotation. Hatter now Look at on this. The road. A masterclass. Uh -oh. A masterclass. Uh oh. Uh oh. Five seconds. <laughs> Five. Four. Hatter. Three. Is he Two, fast enough? One. He's not fast enough. It's over. Tutorial level. They take it's a it. Cap? No, it's not a cap. It's not a cap. No cap. Hatter. No cap. Hatter whiffs. He whiffs the cap. He whiffs that it. That was. Five seconds, chum. Oh, wow. I mean, the pressure. The pressure that you're under. You know, yeah. when Unreal. you pick up your tablet and you see those digits in the bottom left hand corner. And, um. Then you've got to type in a seven-digit code. Yeah. Wow. Radar. Tutorial level. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> Radar Jeez. cleans up a, a, a 2K right here. Look at this. Beautiful swing. Found Hoochie. Apologize for the stuttering. It is not my network. It is indeed the, the server. I'm not sure what's going on. I do apologize for the stuttering, but we're here. We're rocking. Maybe seeing a... Nope. Maybe seeing someone hop in as a replacement to Legil. Yep. Just... Incredible. Th this is a... This is a throwback jump to the, the yeah. peak of... And I guess we are re-peaking because... This is exactly what it was like in season 11 and 12. Oh, yeah. If you guys were not around then, this is the type of gameplay that the masses came here for. And just the precision and the coordination of both teams to a point where we're seeing 1v1s, baits and switches, playing time, you know, 4v1s in some, <laughs> in some instances. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a masterclass. It really is. Wow. And if you're if you're tutorial level, I'm not gonna discount them yet. Yeah. Because we're a one one standstill, but if you're tutorial leveling, you reevaluate your your circumstances here and say, okay, we came in on the pretense we were gonna play for a bit of fun. You know, their, me the, their whole mission statement was no scrims, <laughs> no matches, right. or just play a league match and have a bit of fun. And they come in 
on their first week, bear in mind, and nearly take two maps from NFI, who are drill five, six in scrims and matches, who yeah. are active for all of their downtime. It it really is a statement. And do I want to see Boss Fight come back? Wholeheartedly, yes. <laughs> we had this discussion before we before we hit the desk. But uh, I, I'd really love to see them come back in a more serious note. Because if this isn't serious, then what is, Chum? I think it's a really good thing for, for the community, for, for Tutorial being back. It's, uh, it's an opportunity for newcomers to EU and NA to look up to these giants, these actual professionals. Um, right, who have, who have been on the stage before and we're trying to do it again now, but they have the experience that not quite everybody have. Uh, we did have Hoochie on, on No Fun Intended. Hoochie has played since season two. So Hoochie is a very experienced player, lots of know-how. The metas have moved on to, you know, faster flicks. Everybody's gotten better gun game, better, better movement. But tutorial level, you can see No Fun Intended are de in the top two, are the second best team in the EU but tutorial level they have something to say and, and I think yeah go for it I'd always argue in any game not just onward that there's always an element of skill inflation as mm. more people play the game and the longer time people spend playing the game right the better people get yeah absolutely well, boss fight of come in and made me contemplate my my <laughs> stance on skill inflation <laughs> the, the way that they're playing definitely doesn't coincide with that theory well um back into round three southern objective and surreal level getting the quick spawn i know mm. they love a good smoke rush cap let's do it let's see if they uh let's see if he's got that m three in hand Round number three, folks, underway, mid OBJ, tutorial level, quick west spawn. Pick up town here, let my beginning position try and get some snipes. Do you see Scoob leaving the server? Yeah, Scooby has Surprising left. Uh, Legend and Archer back in there. Wow, Sog's Whoa. downed! Oh. Archer! Maybe I killed that him. precision! First kill. Tap. Yeah. How long? Double tap. There it is. <laughs> double tap. Hatter, that rotation is key. Look at this. Smoke, smoke. Maybe not ready for Viper. Oh, okay, careful, dead rush. shot. Dead shot, placing themselves at this window, may have bitten off more than they can chew. Radar and Nardu. On their doorstep. Oh my gosh, but Deadshot know what they're doing. Oh, there's Archer great, down. Great. A good refrag by Hoochie. A smoke out from the kill room. It's Radar. Banking. Oh my god, Hoochie goes down. Somehow Nardu found that kill. And there goes Legel out of the picture. Oh, Radar as well. Brutal kills one by one. Tutorial level. Made it two. Dropping like flies. 3v2 situation and three. Viper really needs to find his pick up the hearts back here. Nadu, sit down, tuck in. Viper peeks this, does he check it? Oh, Raz may go down, no, are they peeking? They are peeking, Nardu does see it at the last minute. Also Some interesting call outs, here comes Mad Hatter. Is checking the east yep. cross, but they may not be ready for Viper because the timing is just off. Here comes Viper proning. We may see a kill. Here comes Viper. A sigh of determination. Hatter on the chopping yeah, block. Timing. Viper's peripherals. Are you ready, Viper? Mad Hatter completely yeah. exposed. Oh my god! <laughs> Deadshot goes down! Hatter takes the refrag. Good kill. It's a 1v2. Raz on OBJ, this is not enough. OBJ is completely exposed. And Nadu's got all the time in the world. I keep saying this, but boss fight, tutorial level, ah, 
the gold standard when it comes to a good old bait and switch. Mm -hmm. Look at Nadu. They think that he's going to cross the road. NFI both trained into the west side of this map and Adder, again, back exposed. Depending on where this last tutorial level player goes, Mad Hatter may have the advantage of curing audio cues first. There goes Nardu. Yeah, perfect. Slow. Slow and steady. A lot of audio by Nardu. A lot of audio. Two minutes thirty. They have some time left. Hatter's just just close enough to start hearing this. Maybe not 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 really. Maybe a little bit more. And Nardu. Wow, look at that. Nardu. Adjusts perfectly. And now stealth walking. Hatter is now the one to give out the audio cues. Gray, we may see a Nardu frag onto Hatter here. And if we if we see Nardu find Hatter, then it's down to that 1v1 situation again. Right. Fortunately, Cross, but I'm not gonna get tutorial level have no, no, a man, I have lot more time to play with. Hatter rotating. A lot of audio. But rotates to a more exposed position. If, if Mad Nardu. Hatter gives a call out in his position, Nardu can actually triangulate and pinpoint exactly where this Volk player is. Because what Nardu thinks is that Hatter rotated far east. Yeah, and Raz... Hatter! Oof. <gasps> now here's the audio. Uh-oh, one minute, 30. Here goes Nardu. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. uh -oh. Raz may find this pick. No, Raz doesn't. Nardu needs to be careful. Rotates off. Uh oh, here comes Raz. May find this pick onto Nardu. Ooh, see a sliver. There's the kill with the headshot. Good headshot by Raz. Yeah, pinched, Greg. I think they were just pinched. Nothing you can do about that. Yeah. I mean, Nadu makes the wrong amount of noise at the wrong amount of time. Right. It was perfectly coordinated until, you know, he, he runs into that blue room. He, he understood that he was in a 1v question mark situation. <laughs> he needed to find that pick. Right. But giving the opposition, especially when you know where he is, the same amount of information that you have. Right. It is just <laughs> it's a recipe for disaster. I mean, we could have saw a trade or we saw that and if I quite comfortably coordinated the, the, the pinch on to Nadu, which which one the right we can't take too much away from it. It was the Marsock, and yes, and if I won the vault, but from the converse, boss fight need to take a Marsock because it's their map pick. Okay, so let's do this. Tutorial level, if they do end up losing this series, where do they go after this? I think they have quite... Are you familiar with MMR? I think that MMR will calculate their points against No Fun Intended. Are they going to get matched so, up again with Diamond? Diamond Plus? So, within the VRML, right. each player holds a MMR value. So if you leave a team and join another team, then the MMR will somewhat carry over. Yeah. You know, we've seen Boss Fight move to tutorial level, which means, yes, they are still Diamond Master players, hence why they got matched up with uh, <laughs> uh, NFI in the first, first week, but... I'm unsure Boss Fight will not get their matchup until three matches are played. Arguably, they've got so much historical MMR behind them right. that they're going to be master. But I'd love to see how much NFI actually gain from this match because it's been so close. Similar defense and similar attack. Viper. Oh, wow. Look at that. Beautiful smoke. No aggressive lurk from tutorial level just yet, and Sniper!
single tap sods down. The revive can go out. Here comes a flash. It catches all of them, and they finally take out two. Viper, get out of here. Kill two on the street. Kill two on the street. A massacre. A massacre. What? Five v three situation. Nardu will hear this. This is a amazing position. Amazing position. I actually used to play this myself, and this is amazing. They have an AK-12, but you can play this with a beautiful clack, a C4 on this street, on this street, uh, street post, street thing. Uh, am I having a stroke? What is this thing called? English? Uh, <laughs> lamp post? Lamp. Oh, it's a, well, it's that, a that, that, pole. That, that may be the, the British. <laughs> a pole. It's a, it's a pole. This street pole. <laughs> <laughs> is Rose going to swing this? I mean, he can't, he can't just swing this blindly. Who would predict Nadu's position here? It's just too small of an angle. It's a, too small of a spot. I just want to hurt oh so no! Side of my position. Nadu gives out uh, audio cues. Raz will hear this. Looks back to Mad Hatter and shakes their head. Stand still here on the east side, on the west side. What's that? That dude doesn't hear that though. And each getting dangerously close to Viper here. Viper, just I believe it's just Hooch here. There goes Viper down. And look at Nadu. Moving. Ooh, Raz Street saw side. something. Oh, and Nardu has a bad angle. Lack of discipline. Coming to bite them back. Hoochie's on OBJ, essentially. It's all left up to Archer, and it could be a cap. 4-1 here on Bazaar. That's a potential, but, but really nothing... Really needs to start rotating here. Nothing's... And if I play it so slowly. You really want this. Raz has made it across. False information that and will lead you if you're not to a defeat. You draw your angle, you, you don't know if don't they've know crossed. The guys are. That's exactly what happened. Okay, there goes Hoochie. Oh my gosh, the lag. Hoochie identifies Nardu. Rotates back north. Is now in trouble, but so is Nardu. There's Raz with the frag in the back. Bringing it to a three on three. Killed him. Legel Stein's crash now, and NFI really needs to start speeding this up. A 3v3 situation. The only advantage they get is Legel being over in the east. Uh, Archer. Oh, God! I think I got him. I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure. Big headshot by Hatter on OBJ. It's completely open, and here comes Radar crashing back. Are they confident? They seem to be. Legel to their left. Pushing southbound. Hoochie and Hatter crawling their way up. Hey. This could be really dangerous with tutorial level. But the opportunity to cap is slowly slipping away. Radar on objective. Hatter may hear this. It seemed to work a lot. In OBJ, and I find that the slow and methodical approach seemed to just work a lot better against boss fight. Tutorial level. And tutorial level look like they're floundering a bit. There's Raz there. They have a run-in with Raz. Legel, sorry. They have a run-in with Raz. The pressure is now they've only got one minute ten on the clock. And right, right, right. If they take this approach, oh, there's... Oh, Raz on the top floor. I'm about to smoke out OBJ. They could frag Legel if they find that angle. Oh, they may... Oh, they could have seen. But too, too much in the periphery. Legel is not spotted. Yeah, and they make it safely there. Mad Hatter and Hoochie on OBJ. Radar, Radar could fall in. There's the fall. OBJ dead. OBJ dead. Legel needs to crash back. They could put in the uplink. Legel finds one and a quick refrag. No cap from No Fun Intended. No cap. Uplink safe. Only one point.
Wow. That was really effective by NFI. The slow and methodical approach just left Tutorial level guessing. And uh, they ultimately found the picks and didn't give any information to them. Raz, we've been in this situation before, chum. I don't want to call it, but new objective. Tutorial level three, one down. Right. I... <laughs> They're going to pop another suburbia. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't want to throw too much faith at tutorial level, but it seemed to work last time, so let's throw more, more support on the on the table. Hydrate or dihydrate? Because hydrate or dihydrate? My, <laughs> I feel like I'm going to die. Dude, this matchup is something else. Oh my goodness. 54 viewers still sticking with us to map three. Thank you so much for supporting. Please make sure you're subscribed. Share the stream with your friends across onward, even if they are unaware of VRML, even if they are aware, please let them know. We have a VRML Con in-person event. It will be pay your way, uh, but it will be a tournament-based thing, not pay to play. Um, it's going to be fun. July 20th to the 21st, one ticket pays for both days. Do make sure to show up. There will be four games in total there. Onward, Breachers, Veil, and X8. I will be there casting and supporting the production. Folks, thank you for watching and staying with us. Round 5 coming at you now. Bizarre. Tutorial level on Marsoc. New OBJ in the east. Break this down for me, Gray. Oh, hey. uh, my gosh. Double cross. No smokes by NFI. Super risky. Free fire to the north. Viper finds Hooch. Look at Socks. Oh, the tar misses. Good try. And Viper. One Viper does hear Sox that. Socks now trapped. Yeah. In the blue room. And Viper. What? One dead. I, I need help. Her, what a pick. One dead. I need help. I mean, what does. What does. Why does he need help? <laughs> I'm, I'm a bit startled I, by that call. <laughs> oh gosh, what are you okay? Like the shots came from the track or something in the middle, main street middle. Let, let's Legel. talk about Viper. Yeah, yeah, talk to here, him. He, back, on the back row, so it felt like know, was not played. For, for the guys been watching, we mentioned this a few times, but the folks join us at the end. Not off. played since 2021, season 11. And he's hitting headshots like that. Yeah. He's just impressive and... How how does someone keep up that pace? I don't know. But that's why he, he's cl he's classified within the VR community. One, the of, the one of the best snipers out there. I mean, able to just pick up a K17 like that and dome some heads, shave some heads. Wow. Has the best KD on it, uh, on a tutorial level right now. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, God! Kill the guy. Man. Uh, you know the angle someone had you before, Raider? Am I speaking? Into existence, the Viper. <laughs> I mean, <it's... laughs> what a pick! Two headshots in one round. Oh, there's that kill by Hatter. Beautiful kill, and Archer is called out. Good toss. That flash will catch him, or not? Actually, it doesn't catch him. Archer is still in action. Viper operating on tank house. We'll have to worry about SOGS in a moment. Oh, sees a big south player Raz called out, and Raz does identify the sniper here as well. Smoke out. Beautiful smoke. Does it? Does that blind SOGS? Oh, Ledger goes down. What a swing by SOGS. And Archer finds Mad Hatter there on mid road. Really good smoke by SOGS. Oh my gosh, Viper's still here. A, a cooked flash. It will catch them. Sogs with the counter. It will catch Lonely as well. Stand still here on the on the east courtyard. Raz may find Not us. Not ready for Raz. There it is. Big pick by Raz. Two v one. I killed one. Enemy red smoke. Good smoke by Archer, but there's no one to call out to. It's all left up to you. Oh my gosh, Sogs. Oh, Archer! One on one. 
And so much time to play with. Two minutes 30. Raz has got to defend Whoa! his whole objective. The question is, does he have a good echo count? I don't think they do, because Raz was multitasking. They were looking around, hoping. Yeah, I think Archer's got to do, got to run with the, uh, with this tar. I think this is his best option. And this will give him that speed advantage. Absolutely. Raz trained into the same, similar position, looking for that pick. Raz takes this, it's match. Quite a respectable scoreline if he does take this. This could be Tutorial Level's journey to bring this to another 3-3 on map 3 this time. The question is, is boss fight Tutorial Level wasted all of their clutches? Right, right. Or do they have one more, more token in them? We see Raz having to multitask, as you said, Chum. This could leave him open to a a, a potential pick onto, onto Archer. These rotations, Archer locked in to the same position. Do you think Archer has a good echo here? I don't know, but but Archer may hear these footsteps on Raz. And this is it. Whether Raz has to cover multiple angles. Whether whether the Pika's and... advantage comes into Raz's um, advantage. Oh my gosh, 50 seconds. Raz is silent. Oh no, never mind. Archer steadily making their way. Raz is really on their toes here. Archer, they just have to lock in and find that one angle where Ar Raz just falls into them. Yeah, seconds I don't, remaining. Archer has no idea what the kill count is. Oh, Raz could get fragged. Archer's locked in. Him. Do you see the cross? Raz, oh no, it's 4-1. The clutch. It's my house, baby. What? Let's go. Oh my god. Raz. Clutching out for NFI. My god. Full one. Very, G very respectable. Jeez. Great play from both teams. I mean, ah, man. Archer did some work there. Heavy lifting. Yeah. I mean, again, Chum, we were, we were down to a 1v1 situation. For the folks at home, we, we look at the scoreboard and... Yes, NFI won the series, but can we count the amount of one v one situations NFI got put in? Right, that's you know, right. Those could have gone either way. Maybe we, well, I mean, we saw it on Suburbia where you know it was quite de de divisive rounds and uh, decisive rounds, and then a lot of one v ones on Bazaar. I feel which uh, NFI ultimately took, but. We could have had a much closer map. NFI, they take away this series. All three maps locked to them, but tutorial level, they have shown, hey, <laughs> let's not play around. Now, this may be the tutorial level, but the boss fight may come back. Um, yeah, NFI still coming out on top. They have shown that, hey, our familiarity with the map, the progress that we've made, you cannot deny it, um, and you better watch out. And this is this is a testament to, to the competitive nature of Onward. It, you know, it, it just takes a look at that kill by Archer. I mean, that that frag by Archer, that's tough because that tar. It's a tough kill to make, running across the the opening like that. But yeah, what an amazing matchup so far. Gray, any finishing thoughts? Legendary matchup. Hi. This is week one for tutorial level, and if this is the spectacle that they they put up, I can only hope we see improvement. Do we see the return of boss fight is my question. We may. We may. Folks, lock in. This is season 16, week three. Tutorial's beginning. Tutorial level's beginning, but it's definitely not the end. It's been an absolute pleasure to bring to you this just <laughs> mythical matchup tutorial level versus nfi my name was chumbate my co-caster 24 gray 
please do check out uh, the future cast for season 16. It's been an absolute pleasure today. I'll catch you next time. Peace out. RML is brought to you by Downpour Interactive, Helga, the eSports Manager. Thanks for watching VRML.